Check it out, everyone. I'm going to show you how to fix a leaky hose with a few simple tools. First thing you need to do is go shut off the water. Once that's off, you can come back. Make sure you know where your hole is. In my case, this is a pretty significant leak, pretty hard to miss. And then we want to take our scissors and go ahead and cut that off. Cut it off on both sides. Once you have two open ends, you can put them together with this little gadget. This is a male-to-male -male hose fitting end. And you can get these plastic or metal. I'll put the links in my description. If I'm fixing a cheap hose, I just do a cheap fix and use plastic. But if I have a nicer hose, like this one, I'll use a little bit better material and I'll usually go for the metal. But the thicker ones can be three quarter inch. Once you have the free ends, you need to push the hose on either side of this male to male connecting end. There's a few different ways to do this because this can be kind of tricky because the hose can be sometimes too stiff to actually get on. You can use hot water or even a torch to kind of warm up the ends of these to soften up the rubber so it fits on a lot easier. However, I have found that a good pair of gloves and a little bit of elbow grease and I can get them on just fine and it simplifies the process a lot more for me. But before we put these on, you want to throw on a couple of hose clamps. You can put these on after you put on the hose connector. However, it'll save you a lot of time of unscrewing and rescrewing if you do it this way. Once your hose clamp is on and your hose is connected to both ends of the male to male connector, then you can go ahead and put those hose clamps in position and tighten them down. Give these a pretty significant tight because you don't want them going anywhere and you don't want to have to come maintain them later. Go back, turn the water on, test your hose, and you're done. 